Hello everybody, this is Locke Minecraft, and today I'm going to be bringing you a tutorial on how to create worlds with multiverse and how to create portals as well. So what plugins are you going to need? You're going to need a permissions manager, multiverse core, portals, and a chat manager. Well, the chat manager is optional. Then, once you have those installed, you're going to run your command prompt start. Give it a sec to generate everything it needs to do. There we go, looks like it's setting stuff up. Go into your plugins folder. First thing, go to your permissions file and we're going to need to set up a permission for people to go into worlds and the permission is modify multiverse.access.worldname so I haven't set my world name yet but I'm going to call it just in anticipation we're going to call it Q we'll call it world 1 or world 2 so there we go so now anyone in this group can go to world 2 that's the basic permission next what we're going to need to do is go into the multiverse core config which you're going to be opening with notepad plus plus Prefix chat basically means before people's names, it'll tell you what world they're in. So basically it would say, if you were in world one, it would say world one, owner, QUE1124. So we're gonna set this to false because I don't really like it. You can keep it on if you like it. Great, we can get rid of that. You can ignore all the rest. Ignore these important tags, it's not. All right, next, um, we're going to, is that all the plugins set up we need to do? Yes, so everything else. All right, everybody, so we're in. The first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna type slash mvcreate world 2 so we didn't have enough flags there so well information about it so nv create world 2 and we're also going to need to specify if it's a hard world a normal world a creative world whatever so for now we're just going to create a normal survival world so there we go it's creating it'll just take a moment this can uh i mean it's generating a whole world it can be a bit long um but what we're going to need to do next is we're going to type slash 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 mv wand no sorry it's slash mvp wand and this is the multiverse portal wand so did that world finish creating um i have to check darn it um damn it did it load did it load um we're going to assume it loaded whatever and uh what this means is there needs to be a way to get to these worlds so we're going to create a portal so well first thing we're going to do we're going to do slash mvtp world 2 so you can teleport us to world 2. Here we are, world 2, terrific, whole new world, great. Then we're gonna create a portal. It could be out of anything, it doesn't really matter. Um, so here we go, it's our portal. So we're just gonna make it look normal. Next, with our slash MVP wand, we're going to left click one corner and right click the other. And we're gonna do slash MVP create, and then we're gonna type, call this one portal one. And it's going to go to, so that's the name of the portal. The next thing is where it's going. You can just send it to a world or you can send it to a portal. We're going to send it to a portal called Portal 2. Portal 2 is not created yet. That's not a big deal. Next, we're going to go slash MVTP world, so back to the original world, and we're going to create a portal to link it with that one. So again, just create your portal. It can be any shape. It doesn't really matter. Um, all that matters is you can walk through it. All right, here we are. So we're going to left click one side, right click the other, slash MVP create portal we're gonna have to name this one portal 2 because that's what we linked the other one to and then it's going to go to a portal and the portal it's going to is portal 1 there we go now if we jump through portal 2 it's going to take us to portal 1 and we're in the whole new world so that's fairly straightforward that's basically how it works you can create portals within worlds as well you will not be able to go to another world if you don't have access that's why we did that permissions things in the beginning and uh, that's pretty much it. So that's multiverse core and multiverse portals. We also use Notepad++, a permissions manager. And uh, here, let me say something in chat. Oh, um, that's actually because I didn't reload the server after I turned uh, prefix chat off. That's why that happened. Thanks for watching. 